Hello once again, my people, it is I, Veed, and welcome back to Camp Buddy. Last episode, we started the fundraising campaign, so we all know how that's going to go. There's going to be a little bit of angst, and then a little bit of a cheery cheer time, and then we're going to get the place back. Okay, this is number five of doing it. You should know what's expected. <laughs> but we're going to see what gets, what, we're going to see what happens. Let's get started. Okay, how about this one? Wow! Uh, that looks good too, Hunter. I think Miss Yuri would approve of any of these drafts. Hmm. hmm. I'm not sure about the color of this last one, though. Uh, it might not be the best choice for an invitational brochure. Um... I'll go try it with a different theme. <laughs> <laughs> uh, looks like you're really enjoying yourself, Hunter. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, yeah, Skaterel. It's been a while since I last colored in my drawings. I've really just been sketching in black and white ever since I joined the camp. Anyway. But anyway, I want to try this color next, and probably add just a few more details too. It's really interesting how Hunter almost becomes a different person whenever he's working with art. I can tell just how happy his art makes him whenever he's lost himself get lost in it. This is more acceptable, it's like almost 11 at night. <laughs> or maybe my brain's just thinking it's almost midnight, because daylight savings. Hunter! Say, Hunter, I've been thinking about what you told me yesterday. Um, I know you probably haven't considered this, but I could honestly see you attending an art school after the summer. Well... I mean, with your passion and skill, I know you'd be successful if you really choose to pursue it. Really? You really think so, Katero? Yeah. Oh, I know so. But... But what about my... What about my parents? Uh, I'm not really sure... I'm really just not sure. Okay, I was like, part of that looked weird, weird, but probably it's because I might have seen a double space, but I don't know. I'm really just not sure they'd like that idea. Your parents are the most, aren't the most are the most supportive people, huh? Your parents are so close-minded, but isn't this what makes you really happy? Have you tried convincing them? Isn't this what makes you really happy? My personal thing is like, yes, you should go into a job that makes you money. So then that way, you know, you can actually be financially stable. However make money on whatever you're passionate about as well like if you are able to get into a passionate like if you're able to get into a thing where it's like hey i can make money off of this then fucking do it especially when it comes to something that you're passionate about like hunter with his art me with my youtube and my twitch just playing video games and entertaining you guys me being an entertainer so i'm like i'm really passionate about this so i'm like yes isn't this what makes you really happy Hunter? But isn't this what makes you really happy? I'm sure your parents will support you if they see how much you love art. Well... Well, my parents know how much I love my hobbies, and even they think that I'm good at it. Though, knowing just how much they've set up for me, I've never really crossed my mind that I could actually be doing art, be doing art in the future. But... But I think it's still worth a shot to try and convince them. Huh? Do you really believe that... I can even change my parents' minds? Where would I even start? Maybe. Maybe you could just show them how much your art has improved with the, uh, with the fundraising campaign. Since we're making official posters and brochures that'll be mass-produced by the public for the public, I think it's the perfect time to show that art is a successful path for you to follow. Hey boys, how are the drafts coming along? Scoutmaster Yuri. Oh, Miss Yuri, I was able to make a few sample brochure designs. I made around... four, I think. What? What? Already? I've been gone for 30 minutes and you two have already made that many? Well... Well, we wanted to know your opinion on them first. That way we know what to change, lose, or keep. Right, Kidero? Yeah. Yeah. Hunter was... Yep. Hunter here was actually the one who drafted them all. I just gave him some suggestions here and there. Wow. Wow. You're really stepping up your game, Hunter. The future I'm seeing with you for an artist is only growing brighter and brighter. These look so beautiful. I might need some time to decide which one of these will go will go on our official brochure. Oh. Uh, oh, Hunter. Uh, maybe we can adv ask advice from Miss Yuri uh, about what we were talking about. What? Uh, what? Well. Uh, you know, you possibly going to an art school. Oh. Uh, oh, I'm kind of embarrassed to tell Miss Yuri about that, Katero. Um. Uh, who knows? Well, she might actually be able to help us find a way to convince your parents. She's our camp counselor, after all. Like, goddamn. And besides, you've only heard my opinion. The more people you hear from, the better. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I guess so. It's alright. Don't worry, Hunter. I'll be with you every step of the way. Hold Hunter's- Oh, oh. I miss holding my boyfriend's hand. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, yep, yeah, there's Yuri. I 
can't believe you two have developed your relationship so much that you can flirt with each other like this while someone is watching. Wait, wait. It's not what you think. Uh, no, we're not flirting with each other, Miss Yuri. We're, we're just... <laughs> oh, don't mind me here. Just keep doing what you're doing while I fade into the background. Oh my god, I, okay, fun fact, I don't know where that came from, like, the little, like, like, obviously, you know, it's like a little, like, tch, 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 tch. I don't know where it came from, but hi, Key, well, uh, because, hi, TK came, came to visit me for the other day, hi, I'm more public about this, we're dating, uh, <laughs> uh, he came over, uh, probably, like, a month or two ago, I'm, I, I, he came over a month ago, I'm assuming, by the time that this episode goes up, and, uh, the, the, but, I, I, we were having a time, and obviously, uh, it involved, uh, <laughs> as my fans like to call it, camp buddy time. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Uh, and so there was one point where I was just, like, kind of, like, on top of him. Like, we were both, like, still kind of close, and we were, but, like, we were just kind of teasing each other. So, like, I was, like, low-key, like, kind of stripping, and I was just like, and he could not stop laughing and be like, baby, what the fuck are you doing? And I'm like, I'm trying to set the mood, you fucking whore. I love you, though. Ah. I can't believe that the scene is unfolding right before my eyes! Master Yuri. Miss Yuri, shouldn't we be focusing on the brochure? Forget the damn activity and just you get on with it! <sighs> I knew it. Scoutmaster Yoshi. Scout Master Yoshi! Yuri! Yuri, I can hear your voice from the office. Please, keep it down, so a girl might think that something serious is going on. Huh. Cock block. <laughs> oh my god, I love her. <clears throat> Aren't you supposed to be handling the creative department? Correct. I am. Uh, just looking, Mr. Screenfield and Mr. Nagami here have already designed Leah for her campaign brochure. Wow, oh, I'm impressed. Wow, that fast? That's amazing. Excellent work. Good job, you two. <laughs> See? I'm doing my job nicely. Yuri. I'm talking to the scouts, Yuri. <laughs> I love them. Well, well, we were actually asking Miss Yuri about uh, her preferred layout. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we were waiting for her feedback, but we think something might have distracted her a little. Yuri. Yuri. Uh, fine, fine. I'm sorry. All I really have to say is that every one of these designs looks great to me, boys. The only thing that we'll need to see now is if the data I've collected is enough to fit your layout, Hunter. Hmm. Oh, how do we do that, Miss Yuri? Um, we'll move to the computer and convert everything there digitally. Wow. Oh, wow! Amazing. That's so cool, Miss Yuri. I've only seen digital conversion in the books I've read, uh, uh, but I've never seen it. Like, I've never done it myself before. Shall we go? Let's head to the office, shall we? All right. Uh, yes, ma'am. Oh. Uh, oh, hold on a moment, Katero. Uh, may I have a word with you before you leave? You two can go ahead. Anyway... Okay, I start to set up the computer anyway. Catch up quick, alright? Yes, of course. Uh, don't worry, this will only take a minute. Ooh, what's up? What's up? What's up? Are we having a little bit of a daddy son moment? Please no. What can I help you, sir? As a matter of fact. Actually, this is unrelated to the activity today. I just happened to be chatting with Yuri, and she mentioned that she gave you a journal, correct? Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. I've been writing all my different experiences from camp in it. Oh, this is the moment where it's gonna get burned. I'm really loving being able to put stories down with the pictures I take. Very good. That's great. I wish I would have thought about that when I was a scout. I apologize. I apologize if this is imposing on you, but do you mind if I could read your journal at some point? I'd love to see your thoughts on all the camp's activities so far, and maybe use them to make your next year even better. Hmm. I was thinking it could be useful of some sort of feedback on my performance as a scoutmaster. I really want to grow more as a leader. Eh? You really want to meet, read my journal, Skamasuyoshi? I mean, I mean, sure, but for a price. I'm, I, no, no, we're doing Hunter, not you. That's right. <laughs> That's right. I'm sure it'll be really helpful with planning for next year's activities. Sure. Uh, I'd love to show you. I've been recording everything ever since the day that I got the journal. But. Although. Is it alright if I add my latest entries first? Yes, of course. Oh, certainly. I'd love to see an up-to-date version. I appreciate it. Thank you for being so willing to share, Keitaro. I am so excited. Uh, of course, Scoutmaster Yoshi. I'm really excited for you to read it. Anyway. 
Anyway, I won't keep you any longer. You should go catch up with Yuri and Hunter. All right. Oh, right. Thank you. Thanks again, Scamas Yoshi. Man, it's already been 10 minutes. See, this is what I like when I actually am, like, invested in something that isn't repetitive, and then the time goes by quickly. Mm, this old thing takes a lot of time to start up. <laughs> I'm really excited to get started on design or digital art, Miss Yuri. Although, I don't really have any experience in all in creating art on a computer yet. <laughs> That's all right, Hunter. With your draft, we have a great guide. And don't worry, your scat messages no here know a way around a computer as well. Are you sure about that? <laughs> oh. Oh, that's so cool, Miss Yuri. Uh, where did you learn how to do it? Well, well I kind of went to a school for it before. I asked my dad to enroll me in an academy that specialized in multimedia arts when I was younger. Actually, I had, and still have, a lot of ideas in my mind. I kind of wanted to try publishing my own story with my art. But I really just, I'm really just a writer, not an artist. <laughs> Drawing has always been out of my league. So I dropped out eventually, but I did learn a full few cool tricks using cool tricks using art software. Wow, that's amazing! Oh, that sounds cool. Um, um Miss Yuri, I kind of wanted to ask you something. What is it? Oh, what is it, dear? Well, I was wondering, do you think that I could ever qualify for like a legitimate art school one day? What? What? Have you seen your skill? I think you're more than qualified, Hunter. Hmm. You really think that I'd be successful to pursuing art as a career? That's right. Of course, dear. What makes you think you can't? I mean, I see you're very passionate about it, and don't have you even get me started on how much you actually excel in it. Well, well it's just my parents. I don't think they'd ever approve of it. Aww. Oh, I see where you're coming from, Hunter. Huh? Y you do? Actually. Yes. Take it who's someone who's been in that particular field before. Uh, there are more than enough people on the planet who are in the same situation your parents are scared of for you. Art as a career is pretty much a blur in the eyes of some people, especially in the older generations. Period. Trust, I know. Well... They aren't completely at fault, though. In reality, they have only ever been a, a, a few out so many who have made a name for themselves in art. Believe it or not, my mom wasn't the most eager parent when I aspired for this kind of career at a young age. But... But please understand where your parents are coming from. They're just worried about their son. I understand. Yeah, I understand, Miss Yuri. <laughs> I'm sure that if you show them how passionate and determined you are for the path that you want to take, you'll definitely earn their support. Well... I bet they're going to be so proud to see how much you've grown by this passion, this love of yours during this time here at Camp Buddy. And when they do, there won't be any reason for them to deny you art school in the future. I see. Uh, I see. It's all right. Don't fret, Hunter, dear. With your skill and drive, I know you'll become successful someday. You're a smart boy, and you're old enough to make decisions for yourself. That is what I've been saying this whole entire goddamn playthrough. Like, he is 18, 19. Well, like they say, do what you love, and you'll never work a day in your life. That's right. I guess you're right, Miss Yuri. I'll never stop chasing after something I know I can do, uh, I can do great things at. That's the spirit! That's the spirit! <laughs> I mean, that's how I feel. I feel like I don't work at all when it comes to, like, YouTube and Twitch, but, like, uh, she's making money. Uh, oh, by the way, if it'll make you feel better, I know the person who owns an art school. I've heard they're looking for new students after summer. Um, if you're interested, I could pull out the details for you. Really? Really, Miss Yuri? I'd love to join. But... But, but sh I should really ask permission from my parents first. Bitch, you're, like, 18, 19. Do whatever the fuck you want just as long as you have the money for it. Correct. Of course. Mm. Hold up. I, sorry about that. My sister was giving me back my Oculus. Let's go. Now, let's finish this purse and show them what you can do. This is going to be the first thing on your professional portfolio after all. All right. Uh, yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, sorry, Emily, guys. It's okay. Oh, it's all right, Katero. Where did Scott Masuyoshi ask you? Oh, Oh, he was just interested in reviewing the journal Miss Yuri gave me, Hunter. <laughs> Nothing too serious. I see. Oh, I see. Oh, I see they tilde. I saw that tilde or tilde, hee hee. What are you thinking? What are you thinking, Hunter? What are you thinking? Anyway. Anyway, is there anything that I can help with? Well... Well, while I was talking with Hunter here, I was able to recreate his brochure design digitally. Wow, that's amazing. It looks really cool, Miss Yuri. <laughs> this is your design, after all. It's only converted... I only converted it digitally. Anyway... Anyways, Kiro, maybe you can help by operating the printer. The paper and materials are all over there. We'll be ready to print some samples in a few minutes. All right. 
Uh, oh, okay, Miss Yuri. Um... Hmm. We love the sound of a printer going off, girl. Huh? <gasps> what are you doing? Are you alright? Uh, is there something wrong? Um... Uh, I don't know. I just tried turning it on, Miss Yuri. Oh, dear. Uh-oh. <sighs> Looks like it's busted. Huh? Oh, no. Did I break it, Miss Yuri? Um... Uh, no, Kato. Um... I don't think that's the case. This printer hasn't been used in such a long time, after all. I guess it's only natural for it to break down like this. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I'm really sorry, Miss Yuri. Uh, no, Katero, I told you, it's not your fault. I don't even know what I'm talking about, really. Yuri. Well, what should we do, Miss Yuri? Maybe. Maybe we could have someone repair it? Well... Uh, that's the only thing that I can think of. I don't think my dad has the budget for a new printer. Maybe we can all that go ask Aiden to come and take a look at it. He's pretty much the handyman around here because he's thick and he's meaty and he's manly, bitch. Oh. Oh, I'll go and fetch him, Miss Yuri. I, I kind of want to make up for not being here while you guys worked on the brochure. Katero. I'll come with you, Katero. Run along now. Okay, of course you will, sweetie. Now, you two go ahead. I'll be waiting right here. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Miss Yuri. We'll be right back. All right, what we think and what we do and what we do when you're a sweet right. Okay, Sir Aiden should be here somewhere. Well. He said that he was in charge of the bake sale, so he's probably in the kitchen cooking, cooking some sweets. Oh. That explains why it smells so good here. Uh, I'm getting hungry just from the smell. <laughs> Maybe we can grab a snack along the way? That's a great idea. That sounds good, Katerel. Let's hop over to the kitchen. Ouch. Oh, and there's Hero. Hey, Hero, what's good? What's tea? What's up, you fucking whore? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you okay, Hero? Sorry about that. Yeah, sorry. I wasn't watching where I was going. Hero? What's with the boxes, Hero? Oh. Oh, they're for packaging the cookies we're gonna sell. Yeah. Oh, uh, right. Hmm. What are you guys doing here anyway? Uh, we're going to steal Aiden. Oh. Oh, we were looking for a steal Aiden. The printer broke in the office and we wanted to ask him if he could help us fix it. Oh. Oh, right. Hunter went to, uh, Hunter went to go help Miss Yuri with the art stuff, but... I didn't know you volunteered there too, Katero. Hmm. hmm, but since you love to write and take pictures, I guess it does suit you way better after all. Anyway... Uh, anyway, since you guys are here, you can try the sample batch we made for everyone. You can take some of the, uh, you can take some of the way out too. Wow! Wow! That's exactly the kind of snack I've been craving. Oh, god, don't even get me started on craving snacks, girl. Okay, I might go in for another thing of ice cream, like, god damn. <laughs> I guess it would be really nice to try some. Come on! Well, they're in the kitchen with Bro Aiden. Come on, let's go inside. I mean, we need to go see the mans anyways, all right? We need to go see the Mr. Mans. We need to go see the Mr. Mans and get his Bro Mr. Mr. Help. Hey, Bro Aiden! I got the boxes for you. Awesome! That's great, hero. Just put it over there beside the... Oh, oh well, looky here. We have some visitors. Hello. Oh, so Aiden. What's <clears> up? <throat> what are you guys doing here? Well... Oh, Kato and Hero, uh, Katero and Hunter. Jesus Christ, your hero. We're gonna ask if you can help repair something, bro. Hmm. Hmm. What seems to be the problem? Well. Oh, well, uh, it's the printer in the office. <laughs> when I tried turning it on earlier, it broke down all of a sudden. Hmm. We were wondering if we could ask you to help us fix it, Seraiden. If anyone knows how to fix something like this, it's you. Well. Hmm. It's true I know some basic electrical work, but. You know, some beginner's writing, controlling, lighting systems. But computers aren't something I'm really familiar with yet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bro Aiden is an all-around guy, but he's not a miracle worker, guys. <laughs> Except in the kitchen? No, don't pose like that. Okay, I already missed my Mr. Man's enough. I don't need you posing like that. Okay, bitch, bye. <laughs> <laughs> you can see that again. Oh. Uh, oh, we see. Uh, thanks for your time, Sir Aiden. Sorry. Sorry I, if I can't help you boys out much with it. Maybe you could go ask Yoshi about it. If you're talking about the computer in the office, he was the one who bought it. Maybe he has some manual on how to fix it or something. Thank you. Oh, thanks, Sir Aiden. Well, make sure to go and ask Scott Masayoshi next. Hey! Hey, before you leave, don't forget to taste the sample cookies we made. We're calling them buddy cookies. I'm done. Okay. I'm done. Order up! <laughs> Here's the first batch, fresh from the oven. Oh. Oh, they're so cute. Yep. Right? We made them into animal shapes based on everyone's badges. Try one and tell us what you think. All right. All right, I'll try out the frog-shaped ones. Yes, try out them frog-shaped ones. Oh. 
Did I? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, I thought I skipped something. And I'll taste the bunny-shaped ones. Munch, munch. Crunch, crunch. Wow! These are delicious! Yeah! Yeah! I've never tasted anything like this before. Munch, munch. Crunch, crunch. Wait! Aw, oh, glad you like them. But slow down. You guys are gonna choke if you eat that fast. Oh, bitch. <laughs> Hunter's gonna choke on something else later. Whoa! Whoa, looks like you two were starving. Well... If the frog and bunny ones are this good, I bet the others are just as tasty too. Hey! Hey, don't eat them all. We still have to get some to the other campers to taste test. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Hunter. Er, uh, Hunter, the hero. Jesus Christ, I hate you. We couldn't help it. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, hero. They were just a sample after all. We need to improve the recipe anyways. I'm just glad they were tasty. Seems like we're on the right track, though. I'm sure of it. I'm sure you guys will be sold out in no time. If I were a customer, I would definitely buy a lot of these from you guys. Well... Well, if you guys like it so much, why not take the whole box? Uh... What? Are you serious, Sardin? Yep. Yep, like I said, these are basically rejects anyways. Wow, that's amazing! I can't believe that you can call cookies this ta uh, that taste this good rejects! Oh, it's easy. Because, you know, you just gotta approve on the recipe and then make it even better than before. Even if people are like, oh my god, this is so good, you're gonna be like, Yeah, but I can make it better. Garbage. <laughs> <laughs> well, some people out there might think otherwise the second they look at them, so we need to get busy baking more. I'm sure you guys have your hands full in the art department too, don't you? Uh, uh right. Sorry, we got distracted. Thank you so uh, but much. thanks again for the cookies, guys. See you later. Alright, see you guys later. Thank you. Alright, Aiden. Or not Aiden, uh, Yoshi. Where the fuck you at? <laughs> Here on Sir Aiden really know how to cook. Yeah. yeah, those cookies really hit the spot. Oh, girl, listen, I would kill for a cookie right now, okay? That sounds so good right now. Like, period. Anyway. Anyways, should we go look for Skama Suyoshi now? Maybe he can help us with the printer. Oh. Isn't that him with Yoichi Keiro? Yeah. Oh, you're right. Hello. Huh? Yoichi looks pretty aggravated. I wonder what they're up to. Hey! I said give me all your money, old hag! No, that's not how you talk to an old hag, Miss Ma'am. Miss Fair Miss Darling, sweetheart. Okay, first off, you gotta steal her wallet. Okay, you don't ask. Yoichi... That won't do, Yoichi. You need to be more polite if you want people to help you. We'll be talking to strangers, so you have to give them a good impression from the start. Yeah! This is stupid! Why do I have to be polite? Can't I just, like, take their donations by force? Then it's not donation, it's stealing. Uh, excuse me for a second, I'm just gonna do a little quick something. <laughs> she has an Oculus. Because I plan on doing this right after I uh, record because I need to exercise. Period. Alright, we're good. That is, once I get this back on. There we go. I've had these headphones for. I've used. I've worn out these headphones. <laughs> what? Then that would be robbing, Yoichi. You can't steal from people. Come on, let's try again. Hello, Scout Master Yoshi. Yoichi. What are you guys doing? Is Yoichi in trouble again? Huh? Why do you always think I've gotten myself into trouble, Twinkerbell? I'm just practicing how to greet people who make donations to the camp, duh. Oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> Yoichi really is doing his best, though. He just has to adjust his attitude slightly, and he'll be on grave help. Okay, Yoichi. I want you to try saying the line. Good mor morning, sir, ma'am. <laughs> well, uh, we're from Adventure Summer Camp, Camp Buddy. Jesus Christ. Christ, my stutter is so bad today. <laughs> Good morning, idiots. We're from a dying camp with a huge financial debt. Camp shitty. Yoichi, Yo mind your profanity. Pro mind your language. Profanity won't do. Scoutmaster Yoshi. Scoutmaster Yoshi, is Yoichi really the person best suited for this job? Hey! Uh, hey, are you saying I ain't good enough? <sighs> Alright. Okay. Let's just move back. <laughs> Hold up. Okay, let's just move back to something easier. You can leave the talking to me. All you have to do is look presentable, so that grumpy face won't do. Now, now, Yuichi. Remember buddy law number three? What? What? A buddy, o a buddy always flashes a bright dick on someone's face? I hate you. Why do I simp for you? I hate you. <laughs> this is gonna be a long day. Anyway. By the way, what brings you two here? Aren't you two supposed to be handing over brochures with Yuri? Yes, sir. 
Oh, yes, we are, Skemas Yoshi, but we actually came here looking for you. I see. Uh, I see. Is there something that you two need from me for? Well, Story to mention that the printer in the office is yours? That's correct. Yes, the printer and, and the computer. <laughs> I still remember how much of my earnings I had to save to buy them. It took me quite a long time. But, but for the sake of my camper's adventures and learning, I never gave up. As a matter of fact. In this day of age, most knowledge of one could wish for is easily retrieved with the press of a button on a computer. Back in my day, we had to walk all the way to the library, and knowledge was earned by those who worked hard to learn. You are, sound like you're fucking 74. Okay, calm down. <laughs> Don't even get me started on how I first learned the- Oh my god! Oh, for god's sake, would you shut up and just get this over with? Yoichi, what did I tell you about keeping your patience? Right. Uh, well anyways, done. what was your concern again, Hunter? Uh, um, well, we had run into a bit of trouble. It seems the printer has stopped working, and we wanted to ask you if you know how to fix it. Oh. Oh, that is quite a dilemma. If that's the case. Uh, well, I knew this day would happen sooner or later. That computer was a second-hand model I bought back then. Well, with its lack of use over the years, I guess it has become a bit ru- ah! Do you know how to fix it or not? I apologize. I'm that. sorry, but I barely ever use this since buying it from the store. Yeah. Is, is this guy for real? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I just found out for myself how hard it was to understand all this tech you guys are into nowadays. I guess I'm just not as hip as you new generations might say. Old geezer? What the hell is... Who, who the hell even uses the word hip? You sound like that old geezer. As I was saying... You know, hip. The fad of the times, or as you new generations call it, trendy. <sighs> oh my god, I feel older just listening to you. Anyway, uh, anyway, we were wondering. Step Masayoshi, do you have some kind of manual that we can use to help us fix the printer? Hmm. I'm not sure if I do. The manual might have been in the box when it was thrown out as well. I see. I see. Well, have you tried asking Aiden? Yeah, we did. Skema Yoshi, but Suryaden told us that he doesn't know all that much about computers either. Yes, of course. I figured. Just like me, he isn't really the techie kind. I apologize. I'm that. sorry, you two, but I don't think that there's anything else I can do to help with your concern today. Go ask Seto, okay? Seto fucking knows, probably. But I can call a technician as soon as I get the chance tomorrow. I just have to finish training Yoichi here for now. Come on! Finally, come on! Let's just get this over with, sharp broke back. Right. Oh, Very well, right. Then. Okay. I suppose we'll continue our rehearsal now. You too. We'll see you scouts another time. What should we do? <sighs> now what do we do? I don't think there's anyone else here in the camp who might know how to fix that printer. Seto might. Okay, he's very much into the electronics. Seto might know exactly what the figgity fact. Fuck. That came out wrong. Bibbidi bobbidi boop. Figgity foggity fuck. To do. That's how I do it. <laughs> I don't think we should come back to Miss Yuri empty-handed either. Um, Maybe we should go ask our friends? I bet there's at least one person who knows something about computers. Yeah, yeah but who? There they are! Cut! Natsumi, you aren't supposed to move precisely 20 centimeters with each step before you enter a scene. I don't uh, understand. Does it matter how if I move exactly that much? Indeed. Of course it does! Viewers will immediately notice the inconsistency and be perturbed by your errors. We need to redo the shot! Oh, period. Let's go. <sighs> oh. oh, oh, Seto! It's Natsumi and Lee! They're probably just the smartest guys here in camp! Oh, why don't we- why didn't we think of asking them before? That's right. Uh, oh, right. Uh, let's go ask them. Natsumi! Hey, Natsumi! What are you guys up to? Hi there! Oh, hello, you two! We're actually working on our own advertisement for the campaign. Oh, you mean like a commercial? Yeah, that's right. That's right. We're going to make a video tour of the camp and then post it online. Sounds nice. That sounds really creative. Anyway. Uh, anyway, you guys need something from us? Well... Well, we were thinking if you could... Hold on. Wait, why should I have to be in the video? I'm already going to be the one who has to edit and upload it. Huh? We need someone to play one of the trees in the background, remember? There's trees fucking everywhere, Lee. No way. No way, you're not making me into a tree. That would look so lame. I lose a ton of followers for sure. <gasps> Oh! <laughs> Maybe now you don't have to. We have two new volunteers. Absolutely! Katero, Hunter, you'll both be excellent side characters in our performance. Please hurry and put on these tree costumes. What? What? Uh, uh, we're not here for that, Lee. We were wondering if you guys could help us instead. 
Hmm? What's the matter, guys? Uh... We were gonna ask if you guys knew anything about the computers. Uh, the printer in the office kind of broke, and none of us know how to fix it. Oh. Oh, I do know a little something about computers. I did build my own PC back at home. Of course you did, you fucking gamer. <laughs> Can you tell me what you lasted, uh, when you lasted the pr- You've come to the right place. I've been studying computer technology and computer information technology for two years. I guess you could say I have a fair share of knowledge in that specific field. What should we do? So, let's begin some ba basic troubleshooting. What seems to be the problem? Well... Well, I really just turned on the power after not using it for a long time. Oh, oh have you tried turning it on and off again? I have a feeling. Ah, that's child's play. Your chair merely had a little electrical power surge caused by a sudden use after a long time of atrof uh, atrophy. Deactivate the printer to reset the internal power module, plug another applicant into the wall outlet, and test the power, then reconnect the printer. Did you mean turning it off and on again? Lee, the fuck. Well, if the problem persists, deconnect the power cord from the rear of the printer, disengage the power cord from the wall outlet, power strip, or surge protector. Um... Um... The what? Uh, ah! Hopeless! Lend me to the source of your problem and I will assist you in fixing it. Lee! Well, but Lee, aren't we supposed to finish our taping today? Well... It can wait. <sighs> Being so capable and talentless and talented in all matters of fields is very strenuous. <laughs> I will lend my knowledge for a while. In the meantime, the Thespian group shall engage in reinvigorating themselves in participation for succeeding su uh, sessions. Or, as your ne uh, Neanderthals would call it, taking a break. Yeah, it's just called taking a break. Okay, I will gladly be a Neanderthal. Shut up. <sighs> you know, he could have just said to unplug and plug it back in again. You know, Lee, being extra is kind of his thing. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll just let him fix this problem himself. <laughs> he seems to be enjoying it, though. That's right. You're right. Hey, you! Hello, aren't you going to lead me to the problem or not? You're lucky tech supporters have a copious amount of patience with their customers. Okay. Oh, right. We'll be right there. Bye! Bye, guys! See you around. <laughs> Good luck. I hope you fix your printer. Thank you. I hope I fix my printer, too. Like, goddamn. There we go. All right. And with that, I am going to go ahead and pause the episode right there. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Veed. I hope you had a wonderful time watching this. I hope that you had a wonderful time watching me get started on this ad campaign, make a brochure, and uh, get Lee to help fix our printer. Make sure to hit the like, comment, subscribe button, down below. You know, hopefully you're out. Make sure to hit that notification bell so no way to miss on any of my uploads. And I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.